Hey guys, welcome to Kenya's Kitchen 88. Today on Kenya's Kitchen 88, we're going to be cooking a delicious salmon and garlic butter shrimp recipe. If you haven't, be sure to hit the like, comment, or subscribe button and let me know what you guys think. I hope you guys enjoy this recipe. So let's get started with seasoning our salmon. We're going to season it with a little bit of the Kinder's blackened seasoning. Then you're going to sprinkle a little bit of the Dash salt-free lemon pepper seasoning. Add a little bit of the Larry's Total seasoning. Then you're going to add the Old Bay Garlic and Herb Seasoning. For this recipe, no need to measure. You're just going to season your salmon and the shrimp just generously, but just not too much. Don't overdo it. Once you season one side of the salmon, be sure to flip it over and season the other side. Next, you're going to take a baking pan or a dish. We're going to spray a little bit of the Pam cooking spray, and then you're going to add your salmon. You're going to squeeze some fresh lemon juice over the salmon, and then we're going to add a few pieces of the butter and then we're gonna add some slices of lemon. You're gonna cover your baking dish with aluminum foil and we're gonna bake it in the oven at 375 for about 15 minutes. For this recipe, I paired it with yellow rice. You can use any brand that you want and just cook according to package instructions. So once the salmon is done, it's gonna come out looking delicious like this. And then we're gonna get ready and we're gonna cook our shrimp. Okay, so for the garlic butter shrimp, we're gonna season it with a little bit of seasoned black pepper. You're gonna add some of the Kinder's blackened seasoning and then we're gonna add the old baked garlic and herb. We're gonna mix that together and we're gonna set that aside. So in a skillet on medium heat, we're gonna melt some butter and then you're gonna add some garlic. You're gonna saute it for about one or two minutes and then we're gonna add our seasoned shrimp. So you're gonna allow your shrimp to cook for about two minutes on one side and then we're gonna flip it over and you're gonna allow it to cook for another two minutes. Halfway through cooking time, you're gonna squeeze some fresh lemon juice over your garlic butter shrimp and once the shrimp is done, your dinner is going to come out looking delicious like this. I hope you guys enjoy this recipe. If you haven't, be sure to hit the like, comment, or subscribe button and let me know what you guys think.